Huh. And Rana's the only one not getting a promotion. I guess she just, just didn't shoot enough. But I wanted to bring back some live ones, so I guess I kind of did get a little back a bit. At least she didn't get shot. I guess she should appreciate that, if nothing else. Yeah, okay, let's do this. Sounds like that would be a good thing. These guys are kind of slow, so I'll upgrade this. I guess this could be good. I know it wasn't easy, but this could really be a turning point in our research. Not only can we interrogate the subject, but bringing an alien back alive provides us with a much better understanding of their physiology. <sighs> Impressive work indeed. Preparations in the containment facility are well underway. Good. We will be in touch, Commander. Alright, uh... Looks great. Hmm. Alright. I guess everyone just needs time to relax now. The subject externally appears as that of a cauc Caucasian male, but I guess it's aged to be approximately 35 years old, although it's quite likely that this is an artificial effect intentionally affixed by the aliens. The specimen is roughly 2 meters in height and weighs just over 80 kilograms. Despite its outward appearance, upon dissection, the creature's unique organ and bone structure is revealed to be distinctly alien in nature. The subject's bones are segmented rather like, a, like the vertebrae of a serpent. This segmented structure appears to give the creature a spectacular range of motions in combat. A large portion of the specimen's thoracic cavity is devoted to enormous glands capable of producing... Oh crap, I... I press that. Uh. We should begin interrogating the alien subject immediately. I'm confident we can safely house it within the containment facility. But I can't say for how long. Um, a thorough, after a thorough chemical analysis, bleh, a large portion of the specimen's thoracic cavity is devoted to enormous glands capable of producing a toxin that has been expelled via ducts with considerable force. After a thorough chemical analysis of the subject's venom, we theorize that it could be used to used to as a powerful disinfectant to treat a soldier's injuries in the field. The research is working to develop means to integrate the substance into existing medicates for future deployment. Targeting another example of a specimen in the field using the unit analysis view may reveal further details about its distinctive combat abilities. There we go. I think we'll hold on there. We need to upgrade our equipment. Some new armor would be maybe nice, but I think upgrading a weapon should be first. I agree. Line. That does seem to be the most pressing of our current research options. We'll begin immediately. I will notify you when a complete report is available. Good. Let's start to understand how their weapons work so we can make our weapons work the same. Just checking something. I guess the medkits have been upgraded then from the analysis of the Thin Men. So, let's wait, see if something happens. <laughs> By the way, could we buy a satellite? Hmm, no, I guess not. Excavation complete. Although the alien weapon fragments provide a limited glimpse into the system utilized in the equipment, we've seen enough to confirm our worst suspicions about the technology, that it is vastly superior to our own. However, I've been encouraged by the rapid development the research team has made in studying the damaged circuitry and electronics we recovered. 
Our initial efforts have already yielded a successful outcome. The new integrated sighting module is created for weaponry, but was heavily influenced by the alien's own targeting system. Scope available for manufacture. Scope. When equipped, this advanced targeting module integrates with XCOM's active heat hot system to offer an insignificant breeze to our soldiers' aim. Used with build by an option. Okay, when well, I get some snipers, that would be nice. Uh, wait a moment. No, it doesn't say here what that did, so... Wait. Code name by Paris. Roswell. Looking Glass. Cigaris. Spark. Mobius. <laughs> cool names. Right. Forty weapon fragments and forty weapon fragments. Yeah, I can see why that would be the case. Although understanding the alien technology is still limited, what we've seen so far is enough to revolutionize combat as we know it. If we are to live in the playing field, we must adapt the alien technology for our own use. This technology has a number of potential applications. I'm sure the science team is eager to begin. I'll notify you as soon as we have something significant to report. Alright, thank you. Uh, now that I think about it, I guess I should check what it's nearing. No. A laboratory, maybe? Hmm. I guess having a laboratory wing would be a good idea. Doesn't require nearly. Where's the power? If I build two laboratories beside each other, I'll be six, and then I can build a power generator at the end. Like so. Alright. Begin a laboratory there. Oh, I'm beginning excavating that. Let's pass time while we wait for something to happen. Alien abductions reported. Commander, we've picked up multiple requests for assistance. Abductions in progress are marked on the hollow globe. Oh. really use some more engineers, but this is moderate difficulty. <sighs> Let's do it. We need those engineers and we can't help everyone. I'm just going to save if I'm doing this. How did I activate this again? Ah, there. We need those engineers. Let's go help them.
loadout. Does anyone have a healing device? No. Well, I guess you are on healing duty, Super Nisa Nita Rice. Yeah, take it and hold it with pride, soldier. Now let's go! We're going to be putting down in Mexico for this mission. We've picked up a local broadcast indicating alien activity within a major metropolitan area. We should get down there and eliminate any hostiles. Okay, site is clear of civilians and multiple hospital elements. Present collateral damage is not a concern. Alright, everyone. No need to rush. There's no bombs to disable, we're not in a hurry. Take your time, pick your targets, and blow them to hell and back. Strike one. This Actually, don't you. blow them back. You're free to engage all hostile contacts in the AO. Don't take any chances. Alright, we appear to have a restaurant here. Of sorts. They may be holding up in there. Right. Let's take this. Slow and carefully. Run and move up behind that trash can. Keep an eye out for, well, <laughs> anything. You keep an eye on things. And you... Well, I guess it's okay if you dash ahead. Well. Nice try though. Now take cover. This guy means business. And I think you just managed to piss them off. Something fierce. Open fire! Open fire! Rana, move forward and get ready to shoot. Bit of a nothing. Rana, you're clear to fire. Damn it. You, get over beside that door too. They got plenty of those in there apparently. Damn, they're going out the back door. They might be trying to flank us. Well, two can play that game. Get behind that car. You move, alien scum! He's coming over the door. Taking a shot. Take cover. Damn it, Solio. Pull back. Pull back. X-ray spotted. Fuck. There are tons of them. Get ready to take out those two with your rocket launcher. Patch yourself up, soldier. Uh, doesn't mean I can't move. Move on out, from, by the way. Yeah, I guess it does.
Fire will. Well, that takes some of the pressure off. Rana, move up. Shoot the damn thing. Open fire. Alien down. Way to go. God damn it. That's one of the bag enhancing its abilities. All right. You're clear. Take them out. Fire at will. Commander, you may want to instruct your men to exercise restraint when using explosives. While certainly effective at killing aliens, they also destroy the artifacts we're hoping to recover from the bodies. Just something to consider. Look, I think we're killing enough aliens to get artifacts off from. You. Move up to the back and find the alien enhancing that thing. You, keep taking shots at that thing. Uh, the door was open. Oh, you got the window, nothing else. Rana, get into the restaurant. Take the shot. Bring it down. Headshot. Uh, I don't think it managed to kill it. Well, I think it managed to disrupt its um, its a uh, connection thingy. Damn it! Son of a bitch. Kill confirmed. Dead in the water here. Oh wait, no, you're not Rana. <laughs> Sorry, my mistake. Okay, Rana, you take up that thing instead. I don't know how you, I mistook you for somebody else. We're All right, reload your weapon. All right, get into the restaurant. Now which thing is it that's going to blow? I'm quite curious. Oh, that thing! Yeah, okay, uh, <clears throat> moving away from it might be, um, advisable. Moving to firing position. Alright, get away from the cars. Take the shot. Got him. Chalk up another one. Yes! We took care of it. No operatives lost. Whew! Well, things are going quite well for us now. And Rana got some kills this time. Oh, my phone is ringing. Excuse me a moment.